Hello everybody, welcome to yet another very very informative and interesting session on the course of basic to advanced of Excel or Google Sheets with ChatGPT. In the previous session, as you can see, we have done the if function. We understood what exactly the if function is, we understood how it works and we also looked at different uses of the if function where how can business analysts, data analysts, scientists, researchers can use the if function even the HR marketing all the all the all the domain whoever is dealing with any kind of data can use the if function and make their everyday job easier faster and smoother. We also practiced a couple of sample data sets wherein we understood how using the if function we can determine whether the product is expired or valid right in today's session we will be learning about the left and right now what exactly is left and right so many times the data is given to us in one cell but with two different names and when we want to split it that is when the left and right function comes to use let us look at it with an example so over here i have got the name of participants and i need to i need to segregate them between the first name and the last name okay so what i'll do is again let me go to my best friend who is helping me all this while that is chat gpt so i'll ask chat gpt again as we have been discussing and i have been repeating it in every session that you need to be extremely clear and precise with your prompts so again i'll say hello i am new to google sheets i have data with the full name that is first and last names of participants i need to segregate the first name and the last name in okay i have missed the spelling of segregate yeah I need to segregate the first name and the last name in separate columns using the left right function please help okay so i've been i'm being extremely clear that i'm using the left right function i need help with the left right function i think the spelling of segregate just needs a correction yeah I need to segregate the left and right, uh, uh, you know, need to segregate the name into first name and last name using the left and right function. And I have also told chat GPT what information I already have. That is the names of participants. So just let me click on enter and see what I get. So it is saying something went wrong while generating if the issue. Okay. So let me just try it once again. Oh, I think now my chat GPT is back to normal. So, um, you know sometimes it acts funny and that is when you know you can just retry it and get it how you want it so it is just telling you first welcome to google sheets and you know how you can use the left and right function to separate the name and it has also told you to find the position of the space so this is how you can find the position of your uh, you know uh, space to locate the space character in cell b2 use the left function to get the first name and in cell c2 use the right function to get the last name so what i'll do is i'll just use this and i have to just replace my a2 with the corresponding cell right okay so this is if your names are mentioned in a2 so here my name is mentioned in b4 so what i'll do is i'll just copy my formula over here paste my formula i mean and here i'll change it to b4 again here i'll change it to b4 okay and uh, let me just see what happens perfect you can see all the names have got separated on its own right so neha shetty i've got only neha rahul kumar rahul sonia tiwari sonia and rohan roy rohan so i just click on this tick mark and i'm all sorted within like 10 seconds i got my entire data segregated as the way i wanted it right now let me use the right function so again what i'll do is i'll use the right function along with len and find functions to get the last name right 
so i just again just like left i'll paste it over here i replace my a2 with b4 because there is where my numbers sorry my data is and one more over here b4 and now let's see what happens perfect as you can see shetty kumar tiwari roy everything has got separated and within few seconds i have got my entire data segregated now imagine here it was only five names what if i was dealing with hundreds and thousands of names imagine you are an hr and you have to separate the names of 1200 1282 employees how will you do it one by one so that is when the left and right function comes to use it is a function that helps you to segregate the first part and the last part of the particular data that you have got now as we have been doing it in all our sessions let us again ask chat gpt to provide us with sample set to practice so first i'll say thank you then can you help me with sample data to practice the left remember to put it in capital left right function on sheets and i press enter as you can see it is giving me the sample data right so it has given me like five more names so i'll just use those five names right i'll copy control c here i do my control v the names are here again i don't need to go back to chat gpt because i can go to my cell number c4 to get the formula from here so i just copy my entire formula right copy and here i will paste but then i have to change my b4 to f4 so what i'll do is i just control v and i'll change my b4 to d4 right because if i use b4 again it will use neha shetty oh again it is doing some uh, you know little something issue it is showing it is showing some error let me just see if removing the space helps oh it is saying it cannot find within shetty means it is going back to my previous command so just let me remove the spacing and see if it's working no it's not working so there is something that is gone wrong let us go back to chat gpt and see okay so let us use this only as it has told us earlier let us not rely on the formula that we used before and let us replace a2 with f4 perfect and now it's working so every time you cannot just you know use uh, the previous formula sometimes you even have to enter the new one and as you can see i just dragged the cursor and i got everything done on its own similarly let us go to chat gpt again and take the formula for the right but this time i will replace again my a2 with f4 so i just replace my a2 with f4 everywhere f4 and again f4 perfect and again it has suggested me autofill with the exact data so this is how you can use the left and right function using chat gpt you will uh, definitely make lots and lots of mistakes but as you learn as you practice you will get the hang of it remember one thing excel is like you know using these different functions on excel is like a recipe the more you practice the better you get at it so today we did the in this particular video we did the left and right function right and in the next video we'll be doing the dative now what is dative all about dative is that if the date of birth is mentioned you can get your age using the dative how does that work that will be finding out in the upcoming session till then i want you to practice the left right as much as you can so all of you those who are dealing with data this is a very very quick and instant way to segregate your data into the first name and the last name and as you know we have seen in the previous session that everybody who is dealing with data needs to be a pro at excel and this is your first step so keep practicing keep learning and i'll be seeing you in the next session till then this is pritesh your trainer for the day signing off see you do not forget to like share and subscribe